Are you looking for information on how you can assist the victims of the Lahaina Maui fires? Well, in this video, I'm actually gonna break down not only places that you can donate money, if you're looking to donate that way, how you can potentially volunteer, provide equipment, all types of things, as well as what types of goods you should and should not be donating if you're gonna be assisting in that format. With that being said, let's jump into it. What's going on guys? Sorry I don't have the high energy that I usually do. Uh, this has been a horrendous event that has happened out in Maui and I actually just got back from Maui helping with the cause to save the Lahaina banyan tree. Um, there's a video you can see right here of uh, I was brought in to basically document that process and to actually get boots on the ground. And you can see from the footage, the fire that has come through has really just taken a huge toll on not only this community, the town, people who live there, the businesses, but also that banyan tree. So we have efforts right now in trying to save that banyan tree to create a little bit of hope for the community of Lahaina. But you're here today because you are interested in donating and figuring out what is the best format to do so. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna break down a couple different ways on how you can assist, whether it's through money, through donating goods, whether it's uh, actually volunteering your own time or equipment that you have. So I'm gonna go through some of those with you right now. Again, guys, if this is your first time here, let me quickly introduce myself. My name is Patrick Longley. I am a resident of Oahu, a lover of the islands of Hawaii and have been here for nearly a decade. I'm also a real estate agent, but we're not talking about that today. We're just talking about how we can help these victims of the Maui fires. So let's jump right into different ways that you can help. Let's first cover what you should and what you shouldn't donate. Number one, do not donate clothes. They don't need more clothes. This is something that's been repeated through the media as well as on many different nonprofit websites is they don't need more clothes. What they need are the following items. Rice, canned goods, protein bars, baby formula, toiletries, toothbrush, and toothpaste, fresh water, toilet paper, paper towels, peanut butter, jelly, canned protein, canned meals, make sure they're the pop-off ones, portable charging stations, wheelchairs, tents, sleeping bags, as well as pillows. Also, another thing they really need is gasoline. Might be a little bit difficult to donate that if you're donating from afar, but just something to keep in mind. Now, in regards to where to donate these items, you can, of course, look in your local area if you're not here on the islands and see if there's a nearby Salvation Army, food bank, but just do a quick Google search in your local area. But if you're here in Oahu, I have a link down below that shows some businesses and also some drop-off locations where you can drop off some stuff. I also have additional links in where you can donate these items in Maui as well as in Vegas. Now, if you're looking to donate items outside of food, like let's say equipment, or if you're looking to assist on the medical side of things or just want to volunteer, there is also a link down below where there's a survey. You can fill it out, get on a volunteer list. They're really not allowing volunteers in right now, but in the near future, we're hoping that they will because we will need all hands on deck. So feel free to fill out that form and you'll be put on the list. Now, the last thing we're gonna talk about is donating money. This is probably gonna be the easiest format if you do not have easy access to these items, to actually donate actual items, or if you're on the mainland and it's just a little bit more challenging, donating money is definitely a very helpful way to help these families. Now, there are two formats essentially that you can do this. You can donate to a large nonprofit like the Red Cross, Maui United, Hawaii Community Foundation, or you can do what I'm doing, which is directly donating to direct families. Now, I have two links. You have the actual GoFundMe page, which shows photos and maybe a larger description of the family that you'd be donating to that's been affected by these wildfires. And then also I have a spreadsheet that has been shared across the islands that has basically everybody organized by who's been donated the least to the most, and then also a short description. So you can kind of decide how you'd want to donate and how you want to make your decision. Is it based on the GoFundMe page with photos and things of that nature with a little bit more of a story? Or if you just want to base it off who has less than other people. It's really up to you and I'll leave that up to your discretion. Also guys, if you guys could do me a huge favor, comment down below if there's anything I missed, just any kind of positive comments that are gonna provide value to anybody who is already watching this video looking at where they should donate, how they should donate, what they should donate. If there's anything I missed, put them in the comment section down below. It's really important for us all to come together, even if you don't live here on the islands, but if you come and visit the islands, this is a time where we all need to come together and help in any way we can. With that being said, if you guys could do me a huge favor to make sure that we get this video out to as many people as possible, please share this video out on your social media. Make sure you click the like button, not just because you like the video, but also because it pushes it up on the top of the ring so that we get the most people to see this video so they have the right direction on how to properly donate and provide their efforts when it comes to helping these victims of the Maui fires. Hope you guys have a beautiful day. Stay safe and thank you for donating. Aloha.